me sitting in LA traffic, Thanos was right. When I entered the theater, a guy was leaving and I heard him say, everyone dies. I shrugged it off as a joke. Until the end, he was half right. Three different Spideys in a decade, we finally get the kid home, and they pull this? Marvel, haven't the webheads been through enough? Headcanon. Thanos waited all these years to collect the stones because he was afraid of Odin and the Ancient One. When he found out that Odin died and Asgard was destroyed, and the Ancient One was killed, he decided it was finally time to collect the stones. When Black Panther started to disintegrate, the up till then silent girl directly next to me leapt from her feet and screamed at the top of her lungs. Scared the absolute fucking shit out of me. Wakanda wasn't forever. I am Groot. I am Steve Rogers. When Thor appeared in Wakanda, the crowd went wild. In my opinion, it was one of the best scenes of the movie. It was just epic. Thor is literally so powerful and so cool. Who would have thought? Do I dare say the best comic book villain ever? Because if he's not, then he's damn close. I can't believe this. I just can't believe this. Weird theory, but I'm thinking maybe it's a possibility that everyone who vanished from the current universe was possibly sent to a different one. Very out there, but I think it'd be a cool dynamic seeing two different perspectives. Stark will go to Fox and get Magneto. Metal Gauntlet? No problem. The real tragedy is that Rocket will never get Bucky's arm. Bro, that movie had me emotionally distressed. It was so much, so fast, you didn't even have time to react, and then, snap. Holy crap. I just watched it, and am I the only one who's furious at it? Like, I can't process why I hated it so much. I am way too emotional right now. Anyone else chuckle when Red Skull seemingly bragged about holding an Infinity Stone in his hand, all while Thanos had four in the gauntlet right beside him? Best superhero landing by a country mile. Deadpool and Spider-Man would have been proud. Our Thanos did nothing wrong. Just got back from my viewing. The credit sequence was legit silent in my theater. I heard a girl sobbing her eyes out so hard her and her mother laughed halfway through the credits. I never talk or cheer during movies, but I caught myself audibly saying, oh shit, at least seven times. That was intense, emotional, and flat out amazing. I need to see it again. Hey guys, I just want to say that I'm completely blown away at the business that Avengers Infinity War has done. I want to thank Kevin Feige, Luis Desposito, Chris Castaldi, the cast and crew of Avengers Infinity War, Swen, who was a major part in helping create Thanos. I thought you did an amazing job, but most of all, the fans, it's become a global event. It's the biggest opening in history, and that's because of you, all the people that grew up with this, all the people that lived this since they were children. Um, I hope that you're satisfied with the result, because I know I am. You know, I'm blown away by the movie. I've seen it twice now, once with my wife and I. We snuck into a theater and saw it and really got to take it in, and it was something else. So thank you guys so much. Without you, this wouldn't happen. Um, the biggest opening in movie history. Wow.